roommates. It looks like Miss Julia Fox and Kanye's West time together was cut short and sweet as the public duo just broke up after a spicy two months together. Now, their breakup has the whole town talking, including Azalea Banks. The pair were seemingly holding it down after Julia Fox appeared on Call Me Daddy podcast where she called Ye her boyfriend and said he's with me now in response to his not so secret feelings for his estranged wife, Kim Kardashian. It's normal, it's human, you know, but I also like know that he's with me now. So, yeah. and that's all that matters. But news of the two split in ways popped off on Valentine's Day, which was seemingly caused by Kanye's Valentine stunts towards Kim K. Ye sent Kimmy Cakes a truckload of red roses and posted the act on IG with the caption, my vision is crystal clear. And this didn't seem to sit well with his now ex Julia Fox. While the two are definitely no longer a pair, a rep for Julia spoke out saying she's had enough drama in past relationships and the last thing she needs is more and that the two remain good friends and collaborators, but they are no longer together. Of course, the internet's tried to paint Julia out to be a heartbroken mess, saying she was tearfully hopping on the jet after the breakup, so you know sis had to clap back at this nonsense saying she hasn't cried since 1997. The uncut gems actress continued to call herself a number one hustler, hinted at a book release, and piped down all the rumors of her being in love with Ye. What y'all think? She's 12 years old or something? Fox admitted she was really running late for a plane that was seemingly jetting her off to NYC to open for Laquan Quinn Smith Fall Winter 2022 New York Fashion Week show and it's clear sis definitely stole the runway, y'all. The model reposted tons of affirmations from her fans and her friends saying she did the dang thing but one person in particular wasn't riding the julia wave azalea banks who's known for her controversial statements in the past went to war with fulia airing her all the way out on her past issues with drug addiction and claimed that she was entitled thinking Ye would ever pick her over his kids and it didn't stop there y'all the rapper was not holding back and dragged yang into the drama too saying she's rejected him on multiple occasions and does it for deals and that Yeezy owes her a lot of money. Well, this caused Julia to release old text messages of Azealia allegedly asking her for drugs and came through with a message warning the rapper to stop speaking on her son. But Azealia clapped back with a vengeance where she shockingly called Julia's son Valentino a crack baby. Woo! Azalea later hopped on IG where she doubled down on the actress saying she was a deadbeat mom and she said she wishes she would try to touch her but ultimately she has her beef resides with Ye owing her that money. I would actually love for you to touch me so I can put you in jail and make you even more deadbeat mother than you already are. At the base of all of this is the fact that Kanye West is not paying me my money. I don't give a about Julie Fox. I really don't. Like, I really don't. I wish I did. I wish I was like as mad as she wants me to be. But Julia seems unbothered by all the hate after she posted several pictures of her beautiful baby boy on IG and confirmed that she loves her child. Meanwhile, Ye has deleted all the tea between him and Kim on IG just as his new documentary Genius premiered on Netflix. Y'all watching or not? Nah? Roomies. This is a reminder that the shade room does not support or condone bullying and or violence in any form. But make sure y'all leave y'all thoughts on all this drama in the comments below.